Here we have a 2017 BMW M3 competition package. Now with this vehicle, you do get the 20 inch M-Star spoke alloy wheels finished in black, all in excellent condition as you can see just there, complemented by the blue M Sports brakes just behind. We've got the Yas Marina blue metallic exterior paintwork, which is in absolutely stunning color. We've got the black kidney grills at the front there. Just look at the presence this thing has. Now coming around to this corner you'll see your second 20 inch alloy wheel. You've then got the color-coded wing mirrors and door handles, black trim around the windows with the privacy glass for the rear passengers. Another thing I'll have to show you is of course the carbon fiber roof and I don't know if it'll pick up on camera okay but there is a look at that absolutely incredible vehicle coming to the rear there's a look at your third 20 inch alloy wheel you've then got the spoiler lip at the rear which really sets the back end off nicely you've got front and rear parking sensors as well as the rear camera and surround view quad exit exhaust tips which look and sound absolutely fantastic m3 badging on the right hand side there and as you can see, the vehicle itself is free from any major marks, dents or scratches. Now there's a closer look at that last alloy wheel. And let's go on to the interior next. So we've got the full black merino leather interior with the contrasting stitching. And how fantastic do those seats look? You've got the ISO fix points within the seats, temperature controls in the middle with the vents, 12 volt connectivity down below. On the doors, we've got our integrated speakers. Again, plenty of leather with the contrasting stitching. Incredibly premium feel throughout the vehicle. Electric window controls and brushed metal handle. Going on to the front now. How fantastic do these seats look? Again, that full black merino leather interior. M3 decals on either side. Now we've got the M Sports colours within the seat belts. Really nice touch. On the doors, we've got our integrated Harman Kardon sound system. Of course, that is a premium sound system on offer, so it sounds fantastic. Electric power folding wing mirror controls with electric windows and your child lock for the rear. Brush metal handle, auto lights on the right. Now we have got the electrical adjustments for both front passengers. The driver benefits from the memory functions there as well. Stepping inside of the vehicle, close the door up. Now, as you can see, we are free from any warning lights on the dashboard. We've then got our multifunctional steering wheel, features like speed limiter and cruise control. You've then got your M1 and M2 buttons, so you can configure specific uh, different variables, including, as you can see here, we've got the engine, suspension, and the steering wheel. You can have sports, comfort, or sports plus for each one, so you can configure each of those for those buttons. You've then got your phone, controls, volume controls, paddle shifters for taking manual control of your gears, auto wipers on the right, auto high beam assist on the left. You've then got your engine start stop button just behind. Coming into the middle, you've got your satellite navigation, which uh, as well as different forms of media connectivity, including DAB, FM and AM radio, music collection, CD slash DVD, Bluetooth audio and USB. We have also got Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Phone communications for making calls or listening to your music from your phone. If I put the vehicle into reverse, you'll see we've got a re reversing parking camera as well as the surround view and visual display both front and rear parking sensors. Now coming on down, you then, if we go into the menu here, got plenty of great features. Say so if we go into my vehicle and then you've got your M drive and M uh, M drive one and M drive two. So there's a lot. You've got a DSC engine, chassis, steering, transmission, heads up display as well. Of course, that is uh, ahead of you. So you can set all of those different variables to individual ones to suit your driving style. And they're just a touch of a button away. Now, if we then go back, you've then got things like your driver profiles and technology in action. We can access our sports displays, etc., to view a live feed of our horsepower and torque just there too. Now, if we come down, you've then got your stereo controls with traffic alerts on the left. Stereo controls, uh, sorry, dual zone climate controls below with heated seat controls for both front passengers. USB connectivity point, you've got additional storage space below there with 12 volt connection. You've also got two good size cup holders below there. Traction control, we've then got our different driving modes like I mentioned before, so the engine, suspension and steering. Of course, we've then got our gear stick with reverse, neutral and drive. You've also got your sport mode as well or manual mode and then you can change gears like so should you wish. 
Now we've then got our control wheel and touchpad in the center for the infotainment screen as well as different shortcuts of course we've got the interior carbon pack as well so we've got carbon fiber here and here which looks absolutely fantastic soft touch lever armrest in the center which does double up as storage and you've got a phone dock in there as well now the vehicle is ready to drive away today with free next day nationwide delivery competitive low finance fresh service fresh mot and it's also hbi clear that is all from me on today's video thank you for watching video test drive of this BMW M3. Now, the purpose of this video test drive today is to show that the vehicle drives exactly how you expect it to. As you can see, back to five steering wheel to keep it straight line, going straight and true, not moving off to the left or to the right hand side. Now, do you have a multi-function steering wheel with power shift on the rear, which did guarantee manual mode. You also have the cruise control and speed, speed limiter, and you also have your M1 and M2 mode, modes, which can then be configured on the screen just in the centre. As I'm going up to the round up now, I'm going to take a left as you would if you test drive this vehicle today. Then I'm going to use the power shift to go through the gears, so you should definitely you know they work exactly how I'd expect them to. So we're coming in third, going to drop it down to second, wait for the car in front of me to gain a bit of distance. Up to third, into fourth, into fifth, back down to fourth, into third, into second. Really is a very nice sounding car this, back to third, into fourth. And to put back into automatic mode on the gear stick, push right and it goes back into D. Now I can also use the gear stick to go through the manual gears as well, pulling down to go up, pushing down to go down. We have your auto wipers, premium power and car speakers, electric power folding mirrors. You have your touchscreen screen in the center where you have your soft side navigation, Bluetooth media, Bluetooth audio, connectivity, rear reversing camera, and all the other features that you have. We have your dual zone climate all two heated front seats, lots of optional extras fit to this car. We also have your carbon fibre inlays inside this vehicle, really does make the, in, the inside of this car really pop. We have a very comfortable full leather seat throughout, two front seats are more of a bucket seat. We have your big M3 plaque on both of them. Both front seats are also heated, so if there's cold winds more, it really does make all the difference. We do have a lot of adjustments for the drive modes. So you can adjust the steering, the suspension, and also the gearbox and engine. Now you can put the gearbox and engine in Efficient, Sport, and Sport Plus. The suspension in Sports Plus, Sport, and Comfort. And also the steering in Sports Plus, Sport, and Comfort. You also have your camera button just down here. Your parking sensor, you can turn your traction control off there as well. Now, I've test driving this vehicle today. You can listen out for anyone to knock or bang. So if you've been listening out during this test drive video, that hasn't been any, which is always a bonus when buying a used car. So right now, we're going to industrial state where we're going to take a right and perform a merge stop straight into reverse just to show you that the brakes work exactly how you expect them to and you'll see pop up in the centre screen the re reversing camera. So merge stop in 3, 2, 1. Hard and see brakes straight into reverse, no issues whatsoever. Rear reversing camera just there as well. Back into drive, press the camera button just there. You do also have your two corner front views. So pulling out of T-junctions, you can also see what's coming towards you if you are blind, blinded by so a bush or a pedestrian. Now, if you haven't answered all of your questions and inquiries, join this test drive video and walk, uh, test drive and walk around video. Please feel free to in contact with the sales team where they can answer any answer questions and also run through some inquiries with you. Now, if you want to go and review this car on the website, please feel free. There's a box where it shows all the optional extras that this car comes with, such as the heads up display, the carbon inlays, and all other different features as well. But that's it for me in this one on video and test drive video. Hope to hear from you soon. Cheers.